Welcome back everyone to Piney Plays the Bjorning. And we're about to head out into the Gordaran area so that we could c collect these figurines and also maybe find Tim Strawley and defeat any of those wolfmen that we encounter there. Now I'm also supposed to be finding some mint, but I want to give precedence to <coughs> taking care of the wolfmen first. That way, if it takes the entire episode, I can take care of it. Take care of it without having to break in the middle of the place. If I remember correctly, I had to stop halfway when I was running with the roomkeeper. Of course, that assumes that I can get all of these. If I remember correctly, that's a bit of a tricky quest in completing everything all at once. But as, I, as I'm level 40 now, if there's a granted quest there that I'm having trouble finishing, I probably will just forget it. Alright, here we go. Maybe I could even find a relic or two. Ikad Guaradan. How appropriate. Yeah, these sorcerers. I have a feeling it's these sorcerers that I'm never going to be able to finish. Right now, I'm going to mainly concentrate on getting the quest that I was sent out to do. And not worrying specifically about the sorcerers. Alright, here we go. Hello, bear invasion! Good. Oh, looks like I didn't need to bother the wolf. Oh, well. I... Well, we still have that D. Kill wolves and the bow shawls, though. I don't seriously expect to. Completed Bjorn's gift. Completed class deeds tier 4. Oh, that's nice. And defeated another one of these guys. And recovered my third figurine. Finally, since the first two were done by the ones that we found near the broken crate. Either that or we got it from the crate. I'm not sure which one we actually got it from. Alright, let's see. Now. Oops! Hello! Fancy meeting you here. Now the question is whether or not I can actually use that thing. We'll find out in a moment. I have had so few. Of these things recently, I can't even remember which are the ones I need for my particular level. Okay, it looks like this is the right one. Requires artisan? Alright. There we go. I have found what remains of this... What? I did? Oh. Oh, good grief. I did find him. Well, that's not good. Yeah, I was hoping he would have gotten out alive. wolf completely and utterly ignored us. Alright, that takes care of all of them. That... Okay, I have the figurines. I've killed ten of these guys. And I'm not going to worry about those crazy sorcerers. Because if I... As I said, I thought they were a real pain when I did it with the Runekeeper, and I'm already level 40 anyway. 
So I'm not going to worry about it. Instead, I'll head back and collect the mint. It's a lot faster when you skip the sorcerer one. I, if I remember correctly, I spent like, almost an entire episode looking for those stupid sorcerers. Alright, so we'll go up here. I think the mint will be this way. And I should change that to be the quest guide focus. Otherwise, it'll take me back into the camp. And that won't be a good idea. Now, let's see. I think it's setting me pretty close to the camp as it is. Alright, mint. Sprig of mint. Right next to this worm. So I guess we'll kill the worm first. Seven million to go. Alright, that's one down. Okay, I need six of these mint. More mint. Slowly get up this hill. Ah, there's another sprig right there. Good. That's four. And all right, we'll do this five. And the last one's here. Okay, this has gone a lot quicker than I was expected. Than I expect. I guess I expected expected to be taking some time in order to finish all of this. So now we could just turn this in. First off, let's see if the toad legs taste any better. It's a sorry day. Very good, Pine Claw. The mint smells very fresh and should cover the foul taste of the toad. Do me a favor and grind it on that grinding stone, will you? Alright, fine. Very well, there you go. Can't you leave me to uh, my misery. The smell has improved some. Uh, but alas, the stew tastes just as freshly turned earth. Uh, what can be done? Might I take a moment of your time? I confess that I am unable to disguise the foul taste of the toad meat, Pineclaw, but perhaps the stew is not a complete loss. Perhaps, if you bring the stew to our host, Candeleth, she will understand how truly desperate we are for something other than crab. I have seen her often standing at the edge of the ruin, down by the stair from here, staring out in Tal Bruin. Boy, they really changed this one. Because originally the whole thing involved a dwarf at the first camp you meet in the entire place, going back and forth and all that fun stuff. What can I do for you? Uh, thank you for this, Claw. I am glad you have recovered Tim Strawley's figurines from the, um, Guaredane. Though I, though I would that you could have saved him from their ravaging. All right. Mind my words, traveler. A ah, pine claw, I see that you remain here still. Perhaps you may help me again. You recovered the wooden figurines that were stolen from Tim Strawley's wagon, and I would that they be brought back to his widow, Nora. It is my hope that she will be able to sell them. Perhaps not as much for her as Tim had hoped to receive south of the mountains, but enough for her to live on for some time, I think. The Strawleys made their home in the town of you want me to go all the way back to Bree? But beyond that, I do not know where to find her. I will not hold you to this task, for the journey is long, but if you will choose to do it, bring Mrs. Strawley the best wishes as well, and tell her of my sorrow. All right. Bring them back to Strawley's widow. 
Hello. Nay, Gavonin. I need not taste the stew to know that it cannot be eaten. The toes of Tau Bruin are most foul. I am not unsympathetic to their plight of these men, Pinecaw, but I bade them leave at once, for the dangers here are great. I even offered to have them escorted safely to the last bridge, but they refused. They believe that we are magical creatures and will soon cause the evils which have befallen this land to vanish. And they do not understand that war is afoot. We cannot offer more than we have. All right, and what's all this about? Oh, deed completed. Oh, yes, of course, those class deeds where I got a trick point. Ooh, let's see what I have here. What can I spend it on? Debilitating bees. Bees form reduces the target's physical mitigation during this duration. All right, I suppose I can do that. Good. I have returned with her answer. I'm sorry. Did you need something? Candeleth will not help us further. She spoke of war, but that is absurd. Elves are secretive people, and I think she just wants to be rid of us. Well, we will not be deterred so easily. I am grateful for your help, but it seems it was of no use. And, oh, do you want anything here? Like a javelin you can't use, a sword you can't use, an earring that actually isn't too bad. I think I'll take the earring or the choice of this. Might and agility and... Ooh. Now that is a nice jacket. And that's not even being part of a set. Alright, then I will take that and... Then we can head over to Bree to give our condolences to the widow. What do you need? How about that? All right, and since I have a port to Bree, and that's why I bothered with the rep, so I could just port over there and not have to worry about taking the long, arduous journey to get here. Okay, now, let us find Nora Strawley. And she should be somewhere around in this direction. Other than the fact that we have a quest arrow pointing us right to there. Uh, let me get rid of the Sorcerers of the Wolf. I don't want that one. I think a little bit more up here. Yeah, because I need... I'm pretty sure it's at the Mudgate. Down in Beggar's Alley. Hello? Hello, Mrs. Strawley. I have some bad news. Hello there. These are my husband's figurines. I would know them anywhere. How'd you come by them? And why the sorrowful face? And... You think you need to repair that window there? Could I speak with you a moment? Don't be ridiculous! My husband is fine! In fact, he's inside the house right now, resting from his ordeal. You see, when those wolfmen attacked the wagon, he wasted no time at all. He broke open the crate of figurines and started throwing them at them. While they were distracted, did he crept by them and down the path and escaped into the woods. He got turned around, or he would have stopped at Ekedekandeleth to see the e elf Tonganel again, but he was already nearly to the last bridge when he regained his bearings. He came home, bemoaning the loss of the figurines, and I put him right to bed to rest. But you have recovered the figurines he meant to sell. He'll be so pleased. I think I will forbid him from making another such journey, however. 
We will sell them here in Bree, and that will be more than enough. Though, I must say, it is too bad that about the poor man you found, whoever he was, he should not have died so. Here, take one of these figurines back to uh, Toganel. I know that Tim will be touched by her thoughtfulness, and he will want her to keep this as a token of her friendship with the Strollies. All right, good. We'll accept that. All right, so calls for joy, and let's see. We will go back to Eket Kandalith. Nice and convenient. That's why I have two milestones. So that I could keep my port at Rivendell and have one for somewhere else. And here we go. And we're back after this long, arduous journey. <laughs> hello. Oh, he uh, hello there. How Remember can I me? Service? Oh, my heart is filled with joy at your tidings, Pine Claw. I will treasure this figurine and think of the Strollies whenever I look upon it. Take this reward with my good wishes, though it is nowhere near the happiness that you have brought me with this news. All right, and this is the grow tenders, the right. Oh, it, I did put on the new piece on there, and that was the woodlands jacket. I don't know where the other half of the woodland set is, but all right. It's obviously, it's not here. Vestments of the Grove. Oh, it's probably for that crazy worm I decided not to track. Oh, well. Just said it was good enough without having to worry about that. All right, we'll take this. Good. And we could sell that. How may I be of service to you? And I think that is it here for the troll shawls. Next time we will head over to Rivendell where we will pick things up and head into the Misty Mountains. But that's for our next episode of Piney Plays The Biorni.